Hello everyone, welcome to Star Stable. Today I'm finally continuing with some quests. It's Monday. Um, I'm doing some more quests with the herds. I I know I have this one, but I will leave it for uh, like the last thing because yeah. Oh my goodness! For some reason I'm yawning a lot, so excuse me. But yeah, I will be doing these quests with the herds. And I did finish the reputation with Redwood Appoint thing, whatever, so I don't have anything to do there anymore. So let's continue. Uh, I found out that max level is 23 actually. And you need 100,000, so yeah, I'm pretty far from that, but. So let's continue. I'm writing me Yorick Wild that I really love. <laughs> okay, let's go. I hope you have a better idea of our herd now. Appre appreciating nature, splashing in the stream, taking life easy. That's what being a forester is about. I wish I could drop everything and give you a tour of the entire village, but I have my hoods full with these two. You know, now that we're not the only herd in this forest, there are two more herds we share the wildwoods with, the mythics and the warriors. You already had a taste of the warriors when you met Ash, but it would be good for you to make a proper introduction to the other herds. Introduce yourself to them if you wish, learn more about the entire village. I would suggest meeting the mythics first. The mythics live the closest to the central tree in the boggy grounds of Tadpole Fence. You should speak to Alder first, the mythic elder. He'll be on the edge of Tailtop Village, closest to the central tree. Good luck. Uh, the mythics are an odd bunch. Oh. Well, they're not that far at all. So they're here. And the warriors are here. Oh. My god. Ooh, there's someone. Oh, yeah. I love how they actually walk around. That's really cool. So they should be here somewhere. Oh. Yeah, this is the horse I want. That's so beautiful. By the light of the sensual, a new face walks upon our sacred soil. The mythics welcome you, Linda Faith Dust. <coughs> <coughs> yes, I know your names. I have seen it. The light of Idun blessed me with visions of her arrivals. I'm Alder, the elder of the mythics. The look on your face. You thought I was psychic or something, didn't you? No, I just have the eyes of a cult, the ears of one too, and some squirrels who let me know what's going on around here. I am the oldest of the mythics, and almost the oldest horse in this forest. Crab apple beat me by three days, but I am by far the wisest. I'm sure we mythics keep our values intact and don't lose sight, unlike the other herds of this forest. Why are they all so competitive? At the core of our herd is the central tree, the giant life warden and the heart of the wildwoods. When Idean planted the central long ago, she infused it with her go goodness. Now its roots spread, sp spread through the forest. Spread. I guess. And <laughs> give life to everything that lives here. Oh god. I wish I could take you to the tree and tell you some more of it, but I'm uh, dealing with a disaster right now. You should meet some more of the herd if you're interested to learn more about us. You can find the rest of the herd north of here, past the central tree, and you will find your way. What kind of disaster is he dealing with? Ooh. Hmm. 
This verse, I love how these verses look like. It's gorgeous. Yeah, I want to get these. Look at that. It's so pretty, isn't it? Wow. I'm confused. Where do I go? Oh, up there maybe? No, I can't go up there. Fuck. Yeah, mm, uh, I'm back. Here? Oh, yes, here. Ooh. I love them. They all have the blue tint. Oh? So this is essential tree. I bet there's a lot of hidden stuff around here. Whoa. I just love how mysterious everything is. Oh, so the first one is, I think, up here. Yeah. Oh, so cute. I'm not coming down, no way, not even for hazelnuts. The eyes, whoa. I won't fall for it again, wait a minute, you're not my mom. Uh, mom doesn't think I'm a squirrel, but she's wrong. It feels so natural to be up in the trees. Wait, you're a fate dust in Linda. That's so cute! The gray world... Roll deers who came to our village, right? I can't believe that real life outsiders have come to the wildwoods. Some of us leave this place to live among you, but mom says we've only had one human who came to visit us. That makes you the second. Hey, Dust, are you dressing up as a human in all of that fabric? You look just like one. In the outside role, horses were gear like this. Yep, yeah, she's cosplay as a human. Well, like, to color for now. But why? If you weigh yourself down with all that fabric, you can't jump as high or climb by trees. I don't have any gear. <laughs> Ooh, the water so pretty. I love you. I'm going this way, I hope I'm correct. <laughs> oh my god! Mythic Meditator. Wow. Look at animation, I love it. Hoo-hoo. <laughs> And breathe, stretch, bow, bow, bow into downward facing squirrel and then lean on your tippy hoofs to rear into the mighty two leg squirrel pose. Have you come to join our grounding exercises? We stretch every day to bring our bodies closer to a dean. I'm not sure how you do it with a body like that though. All paws and no hooves. Tell me, yes, spirit, why you have journeyed to our sacred forest? I was thinking, don't you want to learn about the, your requests? This sort of happened. Well, nothing ever just happened, my friend. Clearly, Aideen wants you to come here for a reason. For what exactly, I'm uncertain. Us mythics are far more deeply connected to this forest than a domesticated horse and their grey rolled friend could be. No offense. I'm so glad that it's like so deep, but still you, you don't need to swim. Okay. 
this, I want this versus so pretty. Bro. Oh my god. My name is Willow. And you're our new friend. And you're our new friends come to visit us from the outside. It's a pleasure to cross paths with you, Faye Dust and Linda. I was just sky gazing. The sky speaks to us, you know? Clouds or stars, there's always a message for us to this deci decipher. The mythics have been looking to the skies for answers for a long, long time. When you look up, what do you see? The constellations, my destiny, dead planets. They're beautiful, aren't they? My favorite is the cluster of stars to the west. The stars spread out like the branches of a, a life warden, a light essential tree. Alright. I hope you are welcomed warmly by us. You were welcomed warmly by us. Now, I would uh, appreciate your help in these times of crisis. Something terrible should happen. Alright, uh. Am I getting any other quest? No, okay, good. Uh, let me read about it. This is interesting. The, the horse I just met, Willow. It's her. It's wait, it's she. It, it's a she. <laughs> and she's. Uh, yeah, I thought it, it was weird, but she had like those tribes here, like warriors. So she was a part of warriors before, but then she joined Mythics. And her sister is Ash. Uh, which is really, really cool. I, I love how connected they are. Our offerings shrine. To the central tree. It was destroyed. We have to rebuild quickly, or else our connection to the central way may to the central may se severe. Se 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 whatever. Would you help us collect some offerings from around the forest? I am. What offerings? A feather? Okay. Ooh. I'm super sleepy. See? She has like the warrior stripes. Collecting something? I don't know. Wow. I just love this. It's so, so cool. <sighs> this will do perfectly. The mythics thank you from the bottom of the central roots, Fate Dust and Linda. I wish you luck on your adventures to meet the final herd, the warriors. The warriors will be awaiting your arrival. If you head to the other side of the fence and ride under the hollow tree, you will find a path lined with the tusks. Follow that path and it will lead you to the warrior's domain. So let's see the let's check out the reputation thing. Hmm. So the final herd. Here, okay, let's see. <laughs> I'm really excited about this. Um, I just very, very, I just, I'm in love with this animation. I'm just very, very tired for some reason. I mean, I'm actually not, but I'm like yawning all the time. Ooh. Ooh, I love it. This is Ash, maybe? Warrior Guard. Look at that, jeez. Wait, who goes there? Stop right there, don't come any further, you're in warrior territory. 
Alright, so let's see. Stay the purpose of your visit, outsider. I've come to meet the warriors. I'm walking around the village. Just a uh, hairless girl on horseback. I've come to meet the warriors. It speaks. You follow horse. You better keep that scroll in check. Alright, you can pass. I've got my eye on you. Move along, outsider. I am... Shit. I am... Ooh! What? What the hell is it? It's a moose! Oh. My god. It's huge! <laughs> Holy moly, it's huge! <laughs> Oh wow! All right. This is very scary, to be honest. Wow, rocker. The newcomer has arrived at the. Okay, at the warrior's domain. New blood in the wildwoods. The guard let you through, so you must have the all clear. I'm Rockon. I keep the herd uh, tough and ready for anything. Racing, smashing pots, drumming, only the best survive. You must be Linda Fate Dust. Talk about the two of you entering our wildwoods has spread like uh, wildfire. Let me give you the generations long history of the mighty warriors. It began with old Whisker Bloodhoof and his venture into the boneyard. This is Ash. Yeah, I remember. The little hairball has come to nose around. What do you even want with us, two legger? Surely what's out there is the grey world it must be more inter interesting than this place, so many of us wouldn't have left otherwise. The scars. Ash, be polite. Linda and Fedas were just looking around. Are you putting up a friendly guys to take them off guard, Rocco? Or have you grown so lax that you won't even challenge an outsider when they intru intrude on our territory? Well, I suppose it would be good for you to prove your intentions to us. Are you up for a challenge, Fred Aston Linda? Jeez. You two look like you might have what it takes to prove yourself to us. Okay, let me read about him. Alright. Head to the warrior's outcrop and speak to the ceremonial drummer, then your initiation will begin. Ooh. I'm excited, I love how many animals are here. All right. Oh, it's, it's there, okay. Oh, fuck. I almost messed it up, shit. Warrior drummer. Uh, Green Hoof enters the ceremonial ground, seeking to put themselves to the test. The day has come for your trial, outsider. Channel the energy of the almighty warrior. We need you to gallop and leap on the drum as fast and loud as you can. And, the only and only then will you be proven in the eyes of the herd. Have you got what it takes? No problemo. 
We have a new champion. Dowtar has proven their strength. Oh, wow. You did it. World travels... Word travels fast around here. The way you leaped off the rock onto the drums, incredible. Your raw strength shines through. Juniper came by asking for you. Uh, came by asking for you. We shouldn't really talk outside of the weekly herd meetings, but I need an exception. You should speak to him. He's waiting for you in Winnie Valley. Wait, Winnie? I love this. <laughs> Alright, let's go back. Moose again! Hello, Moose. <laughs> I bet this is where um, the, the Gary Gold is. Alright, here we are. My dear flowery friend, tragedy has befallen upon us and we are at a loss for what to do. What is happening? Let me just check out the name of the quest. Missing flowers. Okay, I think I'll stop here and I'll do the urns in another video because it's been quite some time now that I'm doing this. So yeah, I don't really like wanna stay for like make it too long of a video. So yeah, uh, that would be it. I. I'm gonna stop here and I'll continue uh, this quest on Friday because on Wednesday I am uh, doing the new quest that is gonna come out and it's about Maya and her new horse. So I hope you enjoy it um, and see you next time. Don't forget to subscribe so you can keep on watching uh, and don't miss out on the new content, especially the live streams. And comment if you want to see anything in particular on the channel. I'm glad to do it. And yeah, thank you so much for all the support. Uh, as always, see you in the next one. Bye bye.